Hey guys, welcome back. Last video I had to unpack this thing through the unboxing. Um, told you guys I wasn't gonna bore you with putting it together because it's probably gonna take me a long time. Surprisingly, it was super duper easy. Um, it was literally just connecting the controller here, the touchscreen controller with the cable. It was taking off all the tape and all the packaging material off of this thing. Um, connecting the power cable, as you can see over here, this power cable and the block back here. And then the uh, dust extraction pipe. They call it a pipe. It's a uh, tubing. It's like a hose. Um, kind of like you'd see maybe like on your exhaust uh, hose from like your dryer, maybe an RRB, something like that. And it does articulate uh, to like an accordion type. Um, came with all the stuff to start off. I was about to start trying out some stuff right now because it does come with this cool little thing to make some business cards. I think it has like five or 10 of them. It's little, uh, black metal, um, business cards that you can engrave on. Um, the only thing is it did tell me that I have to calibrate it first. So at first I was like, uh Oh, let's see how hard this is going to be. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see it in here. Sorry. It's wobbly. I'm going to figure out why the tripod's uh kind of stiff but yeah so you guys can see in there it's super blurry but trust me there's a red dot a blue dot and then on the two sides on each side of it there's a like a little plus sign and what that's doing is that when i put that it's called an art scratch paper so you put it in there you're supposed to tape it down let me see you guys can kind of see i have a little bit of tape here and on the top i just used the regular uh scotch tape the transparent uh, invisible tape just to hold it down it says not to have any bulges or anything like that um and then the tutorial tells you on this card where to go uh, i use the website you can use the qr code whatever I, i'm using my laptop so i didn't do it that way one thing that i will let you guys know that at first i was getting frustrated my phone would not connect to the machine through wi-fi as it's supposed to be able to however my phone runs off of five gigahertz on the router instead of the 2.4. Um, the machine can only do 2.4. So if your phone's on the same Wi-Fi but a different uh, bandwidth or a different length, whatever it is, uh, for the gigahertz, it's not going to connect. So myself, it's too much of a pain to go reconfigure the router to make it to force it to be on 2.4 for my phone. I've done it before. I don't want to do it. So just something to keep in mind. I have my laptop all the time. So there's that. And then the other connection was the um, USB cable. It's a USB-C on this side to A over here. And then that connects to my laptop. So now if you guys see on my laptop, it does have, let me zoom in a little bit, see if it gets any clearer. Yeah. So you can see that's the live image, image of what's on the machine right now. And then I zoom in. So there's a blue and red dot that I told you, you guys can't see in there too well. And then it has the coordinates for the plus sign on the left and then the plus sign on the right. And what it's saying is that because in shipping, the laser or the mechanism moved around a little bit. So what you have to do is recalibrate it. And what it's asking is for these values where the X, or the, I'm sorry, the plus signs are landing right now so that I guess it zeroes it in. So that's where I'm at right now. Um, the next video, next part of the video, I'm sorry, will be me uh, testing out the laser and just giving you a quick update on if it worked as promised and what I'm looking at. Um, once again, I am not sponsored by X Tool. One of the cool things that I've been getting a lot of comments about on different social media is that I'm probably like the only video anybody's ever seen that's not sponsored. Um, and that's pretty cool because I can tell you my honest opinion like, is this thing great or does it suck? And you know, I wasted almost five grand on it. So um, I'll let you guys know. It's my honest opinion. I'm not going to lie to you and tell you, hey, go buy this thing if it's a piece of crap. Um, but if it's great, I'll also let you know as well. Uh, one of the things that I just ask, if you guys please comment, if you guys have it, comment if you're thinking about buying it, what you might use it for. Subscribe to the channel because that's what helps out, especially if one day I'm able to make the channel a little bit bigger. Um, share the link about some of my videos. If you guys have any friends that are into these types of things, go ahead and share my videos as well. Um, and yeah, I'll let you guys know. Thanks guys. Hey guys. So quick update. Um, I was able to load 
uh, everything into that business card module um, for it to do it on the printing. Um, I realized I put my work information for my regular nine to five, so I can't show you what I printed. You'll just have to take my word for it that it looks freaking amazing. I also can't believe how fast it did it. It did a regular business card on those that black metal uh, business card. And I'd say it was maybe uh, about a minute and a half. It said it was going to take about a minute 15. Um, and yeah, I mean, I mean, the precision is just amazing. If you guys can see, I know it's kind of blurry on here, but like this art scratch paper has those two, uh, there you go, kind of focused right there. That precision you see on there is the same thing it did on the card. You can change the font and all that. Um, I'm going to update with another business card. I'll just use like my YouTube channel's name or something like that so you guys can see it. I know uh, I'm a huge skeptic, so I always want to see stuff like that. Keep watching. Uh, if you guys have any questions or anything like that, let me know. Um, I'm going to keep updating you. I love this thing. This thing's so cool. I waited so long for it. I'm glad I finally got it. So, um, as always, please comment, share, subscribe, subscribe to the channel and the notifications and all that. That way you guys can see, because I'm going to be uploading a lot more often, uh, especially with this new machine. Once again, I'm not sponsored. Appreciate you guys. Have a good one.